An appeal court sitting in Port Harcourt has fixed Thursday, 28th of October 2021 to hear and rule on motion for interim order of injunction brought by former national chairman of the PDP, Prince Uche Sekandas, against the PDP and others. Prince Uche Sekandas brought his counsel, Payo Oyetubo, and is asking the court to suspend the October 30th and 31st National Convention of the PDP and allow him the right to preside over the convention. When the matter was mentioned in court, six other members of the PDP drew the attention of the court on their application for joinder. This was not opposed by counsel to seconders and was subsequently granted by the three-man panel of the appeal court. Defendants, counsel, including those who joined in the suit, however, opposed the motion um, for interim injunction by Secundus' counsel. I have an application on behalf of the uh, uh, Prince uh, Uche Secundus uh, to uh, restrain the holding of the National Convention, which is scheduled for 30th and 31st. And so many people came to say they want to join, which caused some uh, delay, and the court felt that it was necessary to hear everyone concerned. So the court has given them opportunity to come and say whatever they want to say. And the matter is adjourned to Thursday. So the court said it would decide whether the convention should go on or not on Thursday. So everybody is waiting for the decision of the court on Thursday. That is when everybody will know whether or not the convention will take place. There's an appeal in 300 against uh, an interim order made by the High Court on 23rd of August. 2021. The court has agreed with us that that appeal is academic. It has therefore been struck out. In appeal number 340 by PDP against my clients and Uche Secundus, PDP's new counsel, upon going through the processes in the appeal, did not see any need for PDP to appeal against the judgment, which is a confirmation of steps taken by officers of PDP. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.